as the world once again stands on the brink of a global crisis, and news headlines are filled with threats and counter threats, one name has been increasingly heard in closed meetings and analytical reports forda deep in the heart of Iran's vast and sun-scorched deserts where the earth cracks under the relentless heat and mirages dance on the horizon lies a place forgotten by time fordo this isn't just another remote Iranian town it's a name whispered in intelligence briefings a place wrapped in layers of secrecy and a strategic stronghold buried beneath mountains if You've never heard of it, that's no accident. Fordo isn't on tourist maps. It doesn't boast ancient ruins or bustling bazaars. Instead, it guards one of the Islamic Republic's most closely kept secrets, hidden deep underground where no satellite or spy can easily reach. The road to Fordo winds through the barren landscapes of Qom province, a region already steeped in religious significance. But while pilgrims flock to the holy city of Qom, Few venture further into the desolate hills where Fordo lurks. The town itself is unremarkable. A scattering of low buildings, dust-covered streets, and the ever-watchful eyes of the revolutionary guards. Yet beneath this sleepy exterior lies a labyrinth of tunnels, fortified chambers, and centrifuges spinning in the dark. This is Iran's nuclear redoubt, a facility so heavily protected that even the most advanced militaries hesitate at the thought of striking it. The story of Fordo begins in the early 2000s, when Western intelligence agencies first caught whispers of a clandestine project burrowing into the mountains. By the time the world learned of its existence in 2009, it was already operational, a masterpiece of subterranean engineering designed to withstand bunker-busting bombs. The facility, officially named the Fordo Fuel Enrichment Plant, was Iran's insurance policy. If their above-ground nuclear sites were ever destroyed, Fordo would ensure the regime's ambitions survived. But Fordo is more than just a nuclear site. It's a symbol of defiance. When sanctions tightened and assassinations picked off Iranian scientists one by one, Fordo became a fortress of resistance. The scientists who work here don't commute. They live nearby their families settled in guarded compounds. The tunnels are said to stretch for miles, some rumors even suggesting hidden exits that emerge in distant valleys. The air inside is filtered, the power supply independent, the walls thick enough to mute the outside world. And then there are the centrifuges, row upon row of them, humming in the artificial glow of underground halls. Uranium spins silently, enriching itself away from prying eyes, the international community has demanded inspections, but Fordo remains a shadowy enigma. Inspectors who do visit are led along carefully controlled paths, never seeing the full picture. Some believe there are levels beneath the E, unknown ones, chambers so secret that even most Iranian officials don't know their purpose. Yet Fordo's existence is an open secret, a chess piece in the high stakes game between Iran and the West. When tensions flare, its name resurfaces in headlines, sometimes as a bargaining chip, other times as a potential target. Military planners, war game scenarios calculating the cost of an airstrike. Would it even work? Or would the mountains swallow the bombs whole, leaving the centrifuges untouched? Beyond the politics, Fordo is a place of eerie quiet. The surrounding desert, once crossed by Silk Road caravans, now sees only the occasional patrol of armed guards. The wind carries whispers of the past, of empires that rose and fell, of secrets buried in the sand and deep below in the heart of the mountain. The machines keep spinning, their rhythm steady, their purpose unwavering. Fordo doesn't just store uranium, it stores the resolve of a nation that has learned to survive under siege. Whether it becomes the spark of a conflict or the key to an uneasy peace, one thing is certain, the world will never stop watching this hidden fortress in the Iranian desert. But despite all the negotiations between the countries, on June 22, 2025, American bombers dropped a bomb on Fordo. According to the latest data, the bunker has been completely eliminated.